Now, your Central Coast forecast from KSBW Weather. This is Phil Framin for Holt Hanley, and this is the view from Fremont Peak looking down upon the low clouds and fog. It looks like we're starting to see a little bit of clearing, and we should see that trend continue throughout the day. Now, right now at the Salinas Municipal Airport is currently 54 degrees. The dew point is 49 and the winds are calm and around the area. Look at how far the low clouds and fog have penetrated. They have filled out the entire Salinas Valley. In fact, Paso Robles is reporting low clouds and fog and the temperatures. Well, we have quite a bit of a hodgepodge ranging from 48 in SoCal to 63 in Big Sur. San Francisco at the airport it is currently 57 degrees and around the state. Well, temperatures are starting to warm up. The sun's been up for a while now. It's all the way up to 48 in Lake Tahoe. Just a couple hours ago, they were in the 30s and it's in the 50s and 60s along the coast, 60s and 70s in the Central Valley and Palm Springs is currently reporting 75 degrees. Later today, Palm Springs is going to get up to 100 and that's not too bad for them in June. 90s throughout the Central Valley, fairly close to normal. And then we have 50s and 60s along the coast. More or less a typical June map for the temperatures. As we take a look at the situation over the last 12 hours, not much is happening. We are in our dry season. That means the storms tend to stay far away from us. We do have a upper level low pressure area off the uh, Vancouver Island. That's not going to affect us. We're just going to see fog and low clouds as we so often do this time of the year. And according to our low cloud and fog model, it looks like the clearest skies or the most sunshine we can expect would be around 430 this afternoon and only from about Watsonville northward along the Santa Cruz coast and all the way up to the San Mateo coast and then parts south looks like they may remain shrouded by low clouds and fog throughout the day today and then tonight the low clouds and fog are expected to move back into the Salinas Valley although maybe not penetrate as far tonight as they have last night and this morning and then tomorrow the low clouds will retreat but not as much as we expect them for today only sunshine around the santa cruz area and most of the coast is expected according to the model to remain under fog and low clouds and then tomorrow night low clouds and fog move in once again we're going to see a lot of this for the next few months as far as the temperatures go today, most places will be a degree or two warmer than they were yesterday. No big changes. Highs in the 60s and 70s in the San Francisco Bay Area. Temperatures also in the 60s to upper 70s in the Santa Cruz County area today. And Moss Landing is going to be a chilly 63 with maybe very little sun warming up to 80 with lots of sunshine in Gilroy and here in the Salinas Valley temperatures warm up as you move southward ranging from 68 in Salinas to 82 in King City and temperatures generally in the 60s to near 70 in the Monterey Bay area and for the next eight days now this is interesting we do expect a slight chance of some light sprinkles Monday and Tuesday not only along the coast but also in the inland areas. And so the inland areas will really see some dramatic cooling beginning on Monday and actually below normal for Monday and Tuesday in the inland areas with that slight chance of a sprinkle. And then temperatures will start to warm up again after Tuesday, getting back up into the 80s Friday and Saturday in the warmest inland areas.